Hey everyone, the week has come to an end and it is time for my weekly recap video. Yeah, I know I have to go to cut my hair, but it will happen one day. So, uh, first of all, today in this video we are going to look at uh, our long-term trading plan uh, and the life signals I posted on Twitter based on it. And after that, we'll check the short-term trading plans which I provided you this week. So first of all, uh, I haven't uploaded a weekly trading plan this week and I met, tried to follow on the weekly trading plan from last week which was based on the USD CAT. Let's see what happened on it. As you can see, I have provided the plan here. We were expecting a bounce from this weekly support area and a reachment to this daily resistance area or in case of a break we expected for the downtrend to cover at least our first sell zone before stopping. Let's see what happened from last week till now. As you can see we saw the break, the price continued down but Unfortunately, it did not reach to the end of our sell zone and exploded back up going again above this weekly support area. Now on this plan, I have posted three live signals and again, unfortunately, I was in a losing streak, not like Valentine who did a great trade on the Palladium, so check out his video and his signal. The the three trades were taken on the M30 time frame, uh, two with 1% investment and one with 0.5% investment. And in both cases, the price uh, continued in our way, giving us a one to one uh, risk reward ratio. Uh, I didn't close those positions and uh, some news hit, which I didn't expect to bring that much volatility, but they brought enough to push the price back up and to hit all of our stop losses. I hope you managed to close in on some of the profits that the positions were making, but if you didn't, well, this happens on the Forex market, so we'll come stronger next week. Now, regarding the short-term training plans, I posted one yesterday based on the USD Japanese yen currency pair. It was uh, made on the 60 minutes time frame and my expectations are for the price to rush up from this uh, small support area here and probably to reach this resistance area. So this was a good uh, spot to make around 50 pips. Let's see how, what happened. As you can see, the plan executed perfectly. It dropped down again to that small support area giving you guys if you missed another chance to, en to enter and then exploded up reaching all the way to this level where currently the price is sort of consolidating so this was from me for this week i hope you managed to make some profits we'll do better next week i promise you that and i thank you very much and have a nice weekend.